Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Moon Man Beyond. Today's episode we're going to be looking at this bad boy. Let's do it! Dawn of the Dead box set from Second Sight Films. <clears throat> Dawn of the Dead, one of my absolute favourite movies of all time. When they released news of this back in 2020, the beginning of the year, I knew I had to have purchased this. It eventually got released, I think, October, November of that year, 2020. For some reason, I was thinking it was last year, but with everything that's went on. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, I've still got the cardboard insert attached to the back. I just, this box set is absolutely tremendous. I mean, look at that, the simplicity of it. The purple with the black and the green. There's the side there, and the back there with the famous threes, where there's no more room in hell, the dead shall walk the earth. Will walk the earth? I'm not pretty sure it shall. Probably wrong. You know me, so let's have a look. Take his hair off, man. Inside, it does include. Oh, there's the artwork. It does include the various cuts of the movies. So you've got the theatrical cut, the extended cut, the general cut, and special features. My favorite is the extended cut that they released in Cannes. I think it's a superior movie. Uh, delves a lot more into the background and characters develop more. Not that there's anything wrong with the original release. The Argento cut's more sort of trimmed down for the gore and stuff like that. It also includes the original soundtrack by Goblin and the original score on CD. Same artwork again on the front and back. They also include, which again, nice artwork, a essay style book, Dawn of the Dead Dissecting the Dead. Absolutely gorgeous, guys. Look at that. And there's the artwork on the back. The purple and red and orange, love that shit. I think again, it's just like, it's not all work like that. It's just, like I say, it's quite thick, it just literally goes. It is mainly a report style book essay with a few colour photos and stuff like that. And, which I also find a nice little release, they included the novel. And again, tremendous artwork front and there's the back I have read the book I did have a release of it a few years ago um, with the white and red uh, cover I'll try and put a picture up somewhere around here see if I can get one on Google but the book really enjoyed the book uh, it does delve into it a bit more but yeah it's nice to have that as well once again Tremendous release from Second Sight Films. When, like, people ask, like, why are you a collector and why do you buy physical media when you can just stream it down well, For this reason alone, absolutely beautiful, beautiful box set. Which is timeless. Um, and you know, you think the price and stuff, it's. Other people have other vices. I mean, is collecting physical media really bad? You know, it's like, if I wanna go, oh, I wanna watch Dawn of the Dead, I'll go and grab it from over here. It just, it sits, it just looks absolutely glorious. It's very, it's rare now out of print, I think. They do have the normal single release, but I knew I had to grab this because it's super popular. But, it still resonates to this day. I know a bit of that and stuff, but I did realize that 
when I'm watching this again, I mean the transfer is absolutely fantastic. Um, Peter, the um, the cop guy in it, the uh, African American. <clears throat> I didn't actually realise that there's a tear rolling down his face when he kills all the um, old people in the apartment block in the basement, which I was quite blown away by. I was like, whoa, I never noticed that in the DVD or the other Blu-ray release I had. So there's been no expense spared on editing and clearing this up to make the best possible release ever. I do believe there's a 4K release as well of this box set, but I just... It's quality wise for the price I paid I cannot complain fantastic stuff reason I love being a collector is for stuff like this I cannot can I go anything higher for praise wise but just a shame now like a lot of films seem to not well the reasons seem to skip out on the bonus features I used to go crazy as a DVD collector I used to buy like two discs because I used to love watching the making of stuff and trailers and featurettes and music videos. Now it's just the Blu rays are going that way where they just release the film. It's got, oh, 40 minutes of extra. Look, back in the day, I used to buy two discs and it would have three hours of bonus features, not fucking 30 minutes or whatever it is. But yeah, it is what it is. So yeah, I just wanted to show you again Dawn of the Dead. If you haven't seen it, you're missing out, not me, so no problem. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll speak to you soon, okay? Bye.